Hi guys and welcome to this new video. In this video, we will understand what is MVC architecture. So what is MVC? MVC stands for Model View Controller and it is a powerful architecture pattern used in software development to separate between the application logic from the user interface. It is just like the Godilocks of coding. Not too hot, not too cold, but just right. And the application code is separated into three components. The model component is like the brain of the operation handling all the data and business logic. The view component is like the face of the operation, presenting the data to the user in a visualizing appealing way. And the controller component is like the glue that holds it all together, coordinating between the model and view and ensuring that everything runs smoothly. So, the model component of the MVC pattern is a crucial element of software development. It is responsible for the data storage and retrieval, handling all the data and business logic of the application. The model communicates with the database or other source to retrieve or modify the data, ensuring its consistency and accuracy. In a way, the model is like the engine of a car. Providing the necessary power to drive the application forward, it needs to be well designed and structured, ensuring that the data is stored and retrieved efficiently and correctly. The model component is vital in building scalable and maintainable software application by separating the data and business logic from the user interface. It allows developers to make changes to one component without affecting the others. The view component in MVC is like the front door of a house. It's responsible for greeting the user and presenting the data in an inviting and a user-friendly way. The view is essentially the user interface of the application, allowing users to interact with the data and the application as a whole. The view is typically created using combination of HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, providing a visually appealing and interactive user experience. It communicates with the controller to update the data or request new data, making sure the user always has access to the most up-to-date information. The controller component in MVC is like the conductor of an orchestra. It is responsible for keeping everything in sync and making sure that the music flows seamlessly. In this case, the music is the application and the controller acts as the middleman between the model and the view components. The controller receives inputs from the view and updates the model accordingly, processing user requests and deciding how to respond. It communicates with the model to retrieve or update data with the view to update the user interface ensuring that everything is kept in sync and working together seamlessly. The controller is essentially the traffic cup of the, of the application, directing the flows of data and ensuring that everything is running smoothly. It is a critical component of the MVC pattern, providing the necessary control and coordination to keep the application running efficiently and effectively. In AVC pattern, there are three key elements, the view, the controller, and the model. Let's take a closer look on how they work together. First, the user interacts with the view, which is responsible for presenting the data to the user and receiving the inputs. When the user interacts with the view, it sends a request to the controller, which acts as the middleman between the view and the model. The controller receives the, the request from the view and then ask the model to provide the data. The model then requests the data from the database and waits for the response. Once the model receives the data from the database, it returns data to the controller, which then updates the view with the new information. Finally, the view renders the content to the user. This process is repeatedly every time the user interacts with the application by separating the responsibilities of the model view and control. The MVC patterns allow for greater flexibility of the application 
making it easy to develop and update over the time. The AVC patterns offer several advantages for software development. By separating the application into three components, it allows for greater flexibility, collaboration, and maintenance. Additionally, code reusability and separation of concerns make it easy to develop and update individual components independently. These advantages make MVC a popular and effective design pattern for boarding scalable and adaptive applications. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.